Hello everyone, EC22X here again. We're on week three of the Yu-Gi-Oh! League. Um, tonight's opponent is kind of scary. They have G-Max Norlex, they have Rebombi, they have Whimsicott, and they also happen to have um, their own Butterfree. Based on what we've seen on their KO sheet, because they actually didn't update like who kill who, they just updated the KO sheet for the last week. I do believe that they're mainly using the strat where they actually belly drumming their G-Max Snorlax and then using redirection with Rage Powder, which I think it's like a, a mistake for my opponents to not expect that. But I, I think when you guys don't get to see the video of someone and it's just the shit, you have to infer what they're doing. But based on, yeah, based on their Snorlax stats, uh, the Butterfree stats, um, they also have the Revombi and then they brought also Rhinogiris. I forgot who they might have brought also in that last week because like I said, I couldn't really, inf uh, I didn't notice. But I think we have a big chance against them because I actually was going to try to play the Butterfree battle with them, but I'm not going to do that. What I'm going to actually instead do is actually have all creamy this time. All creamy is going to be our actually like person to make sure like they start to do sleep powders, um, protect us from that. But what we actually have is uh, a la Kassan in our Ndidi as our potential starters, depending on what they bring. Uh, the reason why is we get to actually do Spanning Force. I don't believe they had any fighting Pokemon, and if they do bring a fighting ball, we can, it's still okay, because uh, we're gonna taunt them, worst case scenario. And uh, the reason why I this, uh, this actually Alakazam is actually more of a supporting set. We decided to, because they have Rebombi, which is that probably their faster Pokemon, uh, my Butterfree wasn't gonna be as useful, and they were also giving it actually safety goggles, so we actually ignored the redirection. But Duradulon is gonna be our key factor. We're gonna try to do a decorate strat with Duradulon. Uh, obviously, this team is actually not very fast or not very slow, so there's no reason for me to Tailwind. If they Tailwind, I'm just gonna do Trick Room with Ndidi. If they don't Tailwind, then we should be 50-50 winning most of the speed battles. Uh, Truff is mostly there, so uh, just to like hopefully do some damage into the Snorlax because we really don't have something to check in the Snorlax. I was trying to get a, a last trait to get a better uh, fighting Pokemon, but finally, like I said in my um, draft leak uh, first video, Trump wasn't my top choice of fighting Pokemon, but it's gonna be key. And if we don't win, though we don't win, I actually wanted to try like the decorate strat. It's very, very hard to pull off, uh, in my opinion, with the speed issues. So we're actually not gonna have them in the front side, I think. Uh, thankfully, most of his Pokemons, except for a few, we are gonna be, like, a f slower or faster, depending on how he wants to really do. I don't think they, uh, they actually should be really scared of Duradulon. Duradulon is a big, big threat for them, and they only have really one Pokemon to actually check my Duradulon. So we'll see what they do. Uh, and like I said, I don't expect us to win, but if we do, that will be really, really huge for us. And we'll see where it goes. BRB with a battle. All right, we have chosen our teams. We are ready for this. Let's see what Tekka has for us. I'm a little nervous, guys. Like I said, there's three big threats in his team, in my opinion, and that's the G-Max Norlax, uh, Revombi, and uh, they're Butterfree. Oh. What do they bring? What do you bring? Show me. All right. So this is actually huge and sucky. They didn't bring the butter. Uh, so they didn't bring the Rebombi, which uh, makes me put in, which makes me really huge. Uh, they did bring the Nine Tails, which again I really don't care for the Nine Tails. They did bring Runerigas too, uh, which I saw and I said I need to double check. But I mean Runerigas mainly for Trick Room. Or like and stuff. They did bring the high dragon. I don't agree with them bringing the high dragon, but they probably had to do it for a check for my Alakazam and Didi start. Um, so there's a high chance they start Snorlax, Quincyco, or Snorlax, uh, Border Free, right? I think I think I'm gonna do this. So we're gonna start the start I want that to be, and if we lose this, like I said, it's not the end of the world. I think they have a really really good team. Um. But we're gonna start in Didia like a Sam and Ken has Ken's and Duradulon in the back. 
No, no, wait, sorry, not Kang Haskan. Oh my god, Kang Haskan was not supposed to be alive for, pretty sure. I don't know, I don't remember. Maybe I messed up. But Dreadlone and Old Creamy in the back, just in case. Uh, I think that will be pretty huge. So, the good thing about starting in DD at like a Sam is that it might have like, oh, they're pretty saying maybe I will do like double, double expanding force, but I have double dashing gleam too. Uh, but my main thing is taunting that GMAX more, like especially with my, um, with my safety goggle where the rage powder is gonna do nothing. So they actually start Wincy Cup nine tails. Uh, that is pretty, pretty interesting. And this is actually pretty huge. Cause they're gonna know that I have safety goggles. This is not the start I expected from them. Um, and then what we could do is probably double spending force. So they, there's a chance that they might have. Um, the question is, is they're gonna trick room? I mean, they're gonna tell win or not. I think it's worth it. If it so, so if I know that they brought their Snorlax, it's better for me to just do expanding force. A hundred percent. Um. We would do like 50-50. So they went for grassy terrain. It's actually pretty huge. Okay, I can respect that. I actually didn't expect that. So I should have double into the nine tails. Especially because I'm faster. That my okay, that doesn't kill me. So we're probably gonna double dashing gleam here. Okay, that's actually pretty good. That's actually pretty good damage. So the Wincy Code probably will set up Tailwind here. Potentially. But we're just gonna double Double dashing gleam. I don't care if they do that. Uh they don't they can't kill so they should focus in killing my uh, I'm faster than that nine tails, so if we can KO the nine tails, that would be pretty good. So let's have Tailwind. Um, this is huge because then I can set Trick Room for next turn. Moonblast, Alakazam, please. Okay, we survived that. I think we get a double KO here now. Yeah, we get a double KO. And the good thing is they didn't set an Aurora Bale. Um, so that's pretty huge. They have to know that my Alakazam has something. Because I, I'm not getting affected by the weather. So this is pretty huge. Uh, we get the double KO. What do you have? Because I don't care if you're faster. If we can get a TR, that will be huge for us. We need a TR now. So they brought Snorlax. So is this a speedy Snorlax? Okay, so we are actually gonna trick room. Because I think this might be a speedy Snorlax, and then we're gonna taunt the Snorlax. Unless he G Max. I, I wanna see if he's greedy enough that he's actually gonna try like belly drum being in front of us. So we're pulling Puff. So they're faster. Are they scar This is actually pretty bad then. I I didn't want them to be able to do that. Yeah. No, that was actually pretty smart. So are they Scarf then? This is mad. They, they, there's a chance that they're going to sweep me here now. I needed a ton off 100%. Uh, but although I, I, I think I played this pretty well, to be quite honest. Uh, given the circumstances. So I do wonder if they are Scarf and they're just gonna like be healing the Snorlax. So that means I have to get rid of uh, the the Butterfree 100%. Uh, so they are gonna Dynamax, so we're gonna Dynamax too. So 
so they set up Tailwind. Uh, we're just gonna do this. And we're just gonna have to hope for the best. So they are faster because they, they Dynamax first. So that means uh, TR should work for our favor. Because otherwise I don't see any reason why they, they did what they did. But they So they probably... wonder if they expected us to have Taunt on our Alaka Sam. The moment of truth. Because I think when the, it, we're in Trick Room, it does so show who is faster. But um, where alone should we go? Because otherwise I, I fail at this. So maybe I don't need a uh, decoray. Okay, so so trick room failed me. Yeah, yeah, that's his GG then. Trick room failed me. Um, no, I don't know what was the point. So maybe either, maybe the tailwind was to actually just get their border free to be faster than my Alakazam. So probably I should protect it. I don't know. That's just one more for that. So they, I think they're Scarf. Okay, they pull and pull. There has to be Scarf. And it's just very unfortunate. Okay. I think we start actually our other star then. That's fine. I think we can probably start do our do London. It's just very unfortunate. Uh, I don't want them to know I have. So they will know that I have Sash too. And that is just very unfortunate. The trick room was to like uh, trick them, but obviously it didn't work. And now they know that uh, we have Sash on this. Um, I really honestly didn't care about the grassy terrain. I think our start was pretty good. Um, it's just unfortunate I didn't think he would try to scarf his uh, butterfree. So his butterfree is a hundred percent scarf. Um, and I, I mean, I mean, he just got two kills with my GMX thing, so I'm not too worried about that. So I think, so should we do the same star against him? I thought our star was pretty good. It's the fact that they kill my um, my thing before they should have kill it. Because I needed that taunt to go out. I 100% needed that taunt to go out. Um, so actually, you know, no, no, we're going to start the same star. I'm going to dare them to start the same star and we're just going to dash and gleam this time. I think it's worth starting the same start. Um, the the f the issue is if I bring Duradulon or if I bring Trough. Um, I forgot. Is it just a special attack? Yes. Oh, it's attack a special attack. So maybe maybe we do a creamy Trough and stuff. Mm. Or maybe can has can uh can has can drop at the back. Let's let's try this. If not, it doesn't work. It's on me. I think it, knowing that they tell win and they're like scarf, um, it's gonna be pretty huge. And we're just gonna dosso, double double and gleam. But yeah, I think my star was pretty good. I uh, just unfortunate about the terrain that I didn't expect. So they started the same star too. This time we're gonna double Das and Gleam. Cause they can change the they can change their terrain, but uh Das and Gleam does a lot of damage. And this time Shu KO them. So I think they might try to set up Tailwind early. So. 
And I actually want them to change the ring because then I can't I can actually fake go. So they should know that I'm actually gonna go for Dazzling Gleam instead of expanding force this time 100 percent So I personally think that the safer thing to do is probably set Aurora Veil and Tailwind. But, I mean, I could be reading them wrong, but I, I personally think that probably is the better choice. Like, so they went with the Grassy Terrain. That's fine. That actually is good for Gith, because I broke Kanga's Can this time. Yeah, I said Aurora Bell. That's smart. So I read one of them. Uh, now I think I'm gonna set up Trick Room. Because I brought Trough in the back. I should actually, you know, taunt them. Yeah, I should have taunted. So Dashing Gleam is not gonna kill, but Expanding Force might kill it. Okay, let's try this. Let's actually swap to Expanding Force to nuke the Wizzing Cone. No, actually, no, no. Double Dazzling Gleam is better. Because Blizzard won't kill me. Set up Tailwind, that's fine. Unless they're probably going to try nuking my Alaka Sam. Which is probably a mistake from me. For doing that. Yeah, we should have dashing uh try to nuke the other thing. Does that kill? Yo, that almost killed. Okay, so I think uh I'm gonna protect a like a Sam this turn. And just dashing gleam again. Actually no. So uh I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna because I don't want them to die just yet. The Aurora Bell is still up for a while. Um so, uh, expanding force into nine tails, and then we're gonna protect our Alakazam. Fake tears into Ndidi. What's a? Oh, they're trying to nuke my Ndidi this time. Damn. Does the spending force kill it? This is an important thing. Might not. Ugh. Yuck. I should have nuked it, uh, Winsick got. Okay. Um. How many turns of, uh, this thing? Yeah, I'm not gonna set up Trick Room this time. Um. I think... I think we do this and we bring out our fake out user and hope for the best. Fake tears into Indeedy. They're really trying to nuke my. Oh, onto Kangaska? Yeah, that's fine. Blizzard. I think this nukes my Indeedy. Yeah, that's so unfortunate. But I want the... Like I said, I want the hell to die. Okay. So, we're probably gonna fake out Whimsicott unless I protect. And we're gonna bring Trough out. But I think we might lose this fight.
I rather fake out at nine tails. I want him to protect Whimsicott. Okay, so they lead in. Dude, I almost killed it. What do you go for? Energy Ball into Kana's Gun, probably? Yeah. Uh, I think we lose this, though. I misplayed very bad. Especially, um... Because I forgot to set up Trick Room. So, we might not have this. I don't know. We'll see. I wanted to try something gimmicky anyway. Okay. They sound sent butter free. Okay, so because they send butter free. Oh, actually, they can't sleep. Eh? Okay, so I think you're the best guy to still uh, kill. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna protect a lack of some and nuke nine tails. I think it's very important to keep my lack alive as long as I can. So I think if we do get, I don't think we're gonna get to round three because I'm using my Dynamax so early. Um. But I think it's important to sleep powder. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Moonblast. Yo, that's a lot. Good thing I'm killing you. So, because I'm pretty sure that's Scarf. If it's not Scarf, I, I'm kind of like... Maybe Paul and Puff is their only attack they had. But um, we're boosting our like, I'm pretty good. And then he's gonna try to sleep powder our like Kassam again, because that's why I protect it. Um, and then we're gonna taunt the Snorlax, because he might even rage powder too. But because we actually have a like Kassam alive, this is actually pretty huge. So we're gonna try for doing that. I want him to go for the belly drum, to be honest. If he doesn't go for the belly drum, it's GG's for me. I need him to go for the belly drum. I need him to go for the belly drum. Go for the belly drum, please. Go for the belly drum. Go for the belly drum. Or he could do, but um, he could do rage powder, which is actually I don't. I don't want him to go for rage powder. But he, he can nuke my. Damn it! He didn't go for the one thing I want. I needed him to go. He didn't risk it. Ah, uh, that's actually pretty good. Cause I think he nukes my uh, like a Sam here. <sighs> Should I go for the attack? Damn it! And go for a sleep powder. We got safety goggle. At least I know they can max guard. But I don't know if they can KO my trough. Yeah, because that Snorlax is so thick. Uh, but we probably, hopefully, get a plus two attack. But he's probably nuking. Yeah, my Alaka Sam. Which is so unfortunate. Okay, so because this is a league, I need to try killing the the water free instead uh but i have nothing for the i don't have anything for the water free max ooze max quake Ugh. yeah i have no effect this is a f oh, very unfortunate thing this is my last turn of dynamics too but the Butterfree can kill me. The Butterfree can kill me, but I need to get a kill. Uh, let's just max knuckle this thing. 
We have to. Yeah, I think the scarf and then, like, I might regret this, but I'm gonna be a plus two. And it doesn't die. Yeah, if we had, if we're not going for the taunt, we would have killed it. What if he can't do me anything? And they're just gonna max replenish. Thankfully, it doesn't hurt me that much. But, uh, I'm, we're plus two. Oh, they had a Brawl Bell. Okay, so superpower, if superpower doesn't kill heal, because they can't max guard, because they're still taunted, pretty sure. Um, yeah. So if this doesn't kill, we're screwed. If this doesn't kill, we're screwed. Oh, we kill! Let's go! It was a crit! I don't know if that matter, but we'll take that crit. Because uh, Butterfree can't do anything to us. So we get to battle her in third time. I, I don't agree with this, but we'll see. <laughs> I'm gonna poison jab it. But yeah, now like they're just gonna try sleep powdering us and other unless I kill it before I burn myself. It's like it's a matter of like how fast I can kill it. <sighs> Maybe I should brought up creamy. Well creamy survived the max replenish. But yeah, I read it right. He they they are scarf. So this is actually pretty huge. Yeah, let's go. Oh, that's good. That's actually pretty good. But they do know more information about my team now. So the question is, is do I start the same star again? I think Alakazam is huge to have. I I need to have the trait of Alakazam regardless. Um, he know he can't sleep me. Um... So if we double spending for them, they don't get Tailwind. Because that would be huge. Not giving them Tailwind at the very beginning would be pretty good. And then we double expanding force on the other Pokemon. Because we force them to, like, go for terrain. 100%. Uh, we could also go for Fake Out. Because, like I said, we didn't get to Fake Out this time. How about we can has kind of like a Sam? We fake up the Winsico ton the because we are faster than their blue the we're still faster than their um little girl. Or we could trick room trough. Or I could do drive through long creamy. So here's the important thing, it's like what do I want to try starting? Do I just pre-set up Duradu Long all creamy? Or do they start the same thing? I mean, I don't see a reason why they don't start the same thing. Because they... <laughs> I feel like they shouldn't bring Butterfree. <sighs> I mean, I still think it's their game. And I still think my star is the best star. Because I have to Dynamax Duradulon. No, I have to Dynamax Trough. Uh, you know what? Let's do this. Why not? Uh, I think it's worth it. I think it's worth bringing the same thing again. I might regret this. <laughs> I might regret starting the same start a third time. But I think we're gonna nuke the... We're gonna nuke the... Because um, we did so much damage the first time. I think we're gonna nuke the nine tails. I'm not scared of their Tailwind. Their Tailwind is not that good anyway. Uh, so they start the same. They start a Whimsico Snorlax. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So here's the thing. They know I have Taunt. They know I have Taunt. They 100% know I have Taunt. So, 
Are they actually gonna eat this? Are they gonna terrain? Is the question. I mean, I think that's is still the safer thing to do. And I think I still taunt. A hundred percent. I still think it's the safer thing to do. Grassy terrain. That's fine. So they didn't Dynamax. So they... Are they going for Belly Drum? Because that's risky. That's so risky from them. Yo, that's so much damage. Oh, that was a crit. Let's go. Okay, they actually did want you to do that. I think it was a mistake. Okay, so we are gonna nuke the Winsico. I don't want Tailwind up. So I think we. So they can't shook it off. Uh, they could Dynamax, but I really don't care. Let's nuke the Winsico. Tailwind, yeah. They still not shouldn't be faster than our Pokemons. Snorlax is a very slow Pokemon. Yep, there we go. So they are eating a spending force in the face. Yo, that's a lot of damage. Snorlax used Fat K. That shouldn't hurt me that much. Yo, that's so much more damage, even though they're not like burn or shit. Okay, so what did they bring? So I can't set up Trick Room, because they're faster still. I mean, there's not only so much more slower. They brought Butterfree. I am pretty sure they're going to try sleeping my Ndidi this time. So we're going to... Um, shoot. That's fine. Uh, we're going to get a... Helping hand out then. And we're just gonna Dassing Gleam them both. I think that's a better thing to do. Oh, unless he's gonna sleep okay, so they did go sleep powder with my Ndidi. Okay, that was a good read. So they're stuck in if I KO something here, please KO it. Oh yuck. If I came probably on my Alakazam, yeah. I mean, I needed it dead anyway. So, I'm okay with that. Oh. Okay. So, I'm okay them sleeping my Kang has can. I can't let them set up uh, the thing. Um, so, we're going to set up our trough now. And... Yeah, we're just gonna fake you out. I can't let them. They could Dynamax, but they're not gonna uh, hit my... Uh, yeah, so they were gonna try for the uh, the thing. Which is good because Trough now gets to... Um, unless they track to sleep my Trough, Trough actually gets to... Um, gets to have the health. And they get got to eat... Like, we did enough damage for them to eat the thing. So this is actually pretty good. Please be onto my Kangaskhan. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Kangaskhan can sleep. I don't care. Like, all they can do is sleep, right? Um, my Now my Trough should have... Um, should have the Flame Orb up. So they can't sleep me. And guess what I'm gonna do? Guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna Dynamax Max Knuckle you. Uh, so here's... <laughs> I have to do this. Because if they have something else, uh, we'll be sucky. So, this is the best thing we can do. Otherwise, it's actually pretty good of them. Because uh, I decided not to bring my... my uh, the one time they decided not to bring my Alcremie. They went full sleep powder. Uh, and I don't have Protect on my Indeedee, right? So... We dress, which is important. And they got Blizzard on. Yuck. They didn't Dynamax their Snorlax. Are they doing a double swapping and they brought Hydreigon? 
No, they didn't. So, um... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm still faster, so... Which is funny, by the way, that I'm still faster with them having Tailwind still. Um... I need... I need Kang has Ken to wake up 100%. Snorlax dies unless they Dynamax Snorlax. Okay, so they didn't Dynamax Snorlax. Can I still sleeping? Uh, Facade onto me. That's whatever. Okay, so... And that's a crit. BS. We get Snorlax out of the plate. We need to know what his last Pokemon is. Because we're plus one attack, which is huge because uh, our Kangaskhan is Life Orb. So we can wake up from that uh, Blizzard. It will be pretty huge. It will be pretty buggy. There's a chance that... I so what is your... Are you going to show me your last Pokemon? Because they're... Wait, what happened? Oh, the terrain level. Okay. The terrain of Oblivion is actually kind of sucky. <sighs> so they send butter free again. They're probably gonna, what, Rage Powder? I mean, I have to max ooze, right? I have to wake up. If we don't wake up, it sucks. Are they Dynamaxing Butterfree? No, actually, no. It do yeah, actually, no, I think they, they Dynamax Ninetales. I think they Dynamax Ninetales, which is kind of scary. They probably gonna nuke Kangaskhan. I will double into Kangaskhan because he's asleep right now. Or I could be wrong. I don't know. But, um, are you rage powdering? No. Hurricane! Hurricane doesn't miss on Blizzard! Are you kidding me? Uh, this is GG's. If they didn't. Fuck. That's so bullshit! That's so bullshit! The fact that they got Hurricane in this. That's, that's, that's such a bad RNG. What is Hurricane like? Attack, Hurricane. What are they, the percent of Hurricane? That was my game though. Oh, we woke up. But, I mean, it doesn't matter. Hurricane. Like, this sucks. Like, they have to miss that Hurricane, but I think the Starfall kills me. Oh, wait. We still have one more Pokemon? Oh, jikes. I didn't know we have one more Pokemon. That's kind of funny. I wish I had Protect. Uh, Hurricane Pokemon. I mean, it just kind of sucks. What What is the percent of Hurricane? Yeah, it's a 70% accuracy. And they get it. <laughs> it's like, so BS. Um, and then, you know, they just kill me here. Because they're faster, right? Oh, and Didi, wake up. Miss it, miss it. Oh, thank God, they missed it. Max Starfall, aren't you? And Didi, please. No. Kanga, do you survive that? Yo, Kanga survived us. Yes, let's go, let's go. Okay, and Didi, you gotta wake up next turn, okay? And Didi, you gotta wake up. This should kill the uh, Ninetales, though. This should 100% kill the Ninetales. Please kill the Ninetales. Thank you, thank you. Oh, let's go, let's go. This is so intense. <laughs> Oh, this is so intense. So, Butterfree is locked into Hurricane. Please keep losing the Hurricane fight. Um, I really wish I'd protect. <laughs> so we need them to miss another Hurricane. Otherwise, we don't win. I don't know. Because they're faster than me. Uh, I think Spending Force is still better. And fire punch. Miss another hurricane, miss another hurricane, miss another. Miss it, miss it, miss it, miss it, miss it. No! Yo, 70% chance and they get two out of three? Please wake up, Indidi. No, come on. This is such an RNG BS. Indidi, I need you to wake up. Indidi, I need you to wake up. They have to miss. Like, this is GG's though. Oh, uh, man, losing to RNG is so BS. Please, miss it, miss it, miss it, miss it. Yo, are you kidding me? Okay, we survived that. Please wake up. Yes, we wake up. We wake up. Kill it, kill it. You have to kill it. Come on. Oh, thank God. Thank God. We win. Yes, let's go. Okay.
Dude, that was too intense. Like, I don't like that those Hurricanes fast, but GG's, dude. GG's. Thank you for the battle. Oh, too intense.